years before testing the first time. I was feeling your pain. Uh -huh. yeah. And uh, when when was that? When did you go? What year did you go for your first test? Two thousand. And what was the reason? Mm -hmm. Why did you feel that you needed to be tested? Okay. To know my status. Is it is it because it's fashionable? What? Is it because it's fashionable in, in Uganda that everybody should know their status? That's why they say mm -hmm. they should look for a medical checkup. Yeah. But you felt, did you feel any problems? No, yeah, I did not feel because at first I got a, a bit of fear. Eh? Because yeah. we Africans, we usually know that we are going to die. Eh? So I had a bit of fear. Yeah. Mm -hmm. After testing, I first year. Oh. So I had to fear for the first time. After you received the result? Mm -hmm. And how did you feel while you were waiting for the result? I feared. Well, what did you decide to do after you were told you were positive? I was yeah. not sure. For the first time. Yeah. So I decided to go for the second time. After how long? I am going to Hmm? 2003. Three years later. Mm. So you tested the second time mm. after three years. Mm. And did your health change? What? Did your health change in those during those three years? I remained the same. And then in 2003, what happened? When you went for a test. For the test? Yeah. I never feared like you for the first time. Okay. Because I knew I'm positive. Yeah. So if you knew you were positive, why should you think about testing again? I continued testing myself. I had wanted it to know. Mm. Because I did not have any sickness, mm -hmm. but when I was going to for check up, they found me positive. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And then you went for the second time in 2003, mm -hmm. and you didn't fear? I did not fear. And what happened? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Nothing. What was the result? Positive. You were positive the second time. Mm. Have you have you ever come across people who tested positive at one place and then tested negative at another place? Yeah. When they tested me for the sixth time, but we need I to was go. negative. Yeah, but first, then in 2003 you tested the positive the mm. second time. Then when did the third occasion arise? When you retested. Five, six, five, six, five, six. Five, five, six. Yeah. Two thousand six. The third time and the fourth time is two thousand and six. Mm. And then the by by now you 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 continue to know that you were positive, but you still wanted to. Check. I went there for the sixth time. Eh? When was that? Oh, eight. 2008, last mm. year. Mm. In December. Yeah. They found me that I was negative. So, how many times did you test positive? Five. Five of them. Five. Mm. And the, on the fifth, uh, on the fifth occasion, that was in 2006. Mm. And then you retested oh, again in 2008, mm. and you were told that the result was negative. Mm. So then, what did you think? I thought that he, those who are checking are deceiving me. The first times, mm. the five, the first five mm. times. Mm. So what did you decide to do? I'm gonna to go back. Again? Hey. 
And was anybody advising you, or were you making all these decisions on your own? I had wanted to be married. And that's why you retested mm. in last year. Mm. And did you tell your partner that you had tested positive five times? My partner? No. No. And did he also go for a test with you? Mm? Yes. And what was the, what were the results? For him, he was negative. Mm. And for you, it was also negative. Mm. So, when when you received your negative result, mm. maybe you were expecting a positive result. Yeah, <laughs> I knew that I'm gonna be positive for the sixth time. So, what was your reaction in the clinic? On receiving a positive result. I was happy. <laughs> For the first time, I went to the main hospital. Mm. Yeah. Yeah. Then the, the other times, I went to other clinics. All in Hoima. Mm. Did you did you receive any of the positive results from a, from a hospital mm. or a government clinic? Mm. For the first time I went to the government. Well, what would your partner have done if you had also got a positive result at that place? Him would have left me. Because people fear. Mm. Is there anything to fear? Uh, when you are positive, they yeah. fear you. I don't fear positive people. But for we Africans, we do fear each other. And why do you think that is? There is death. There is death. Do you believe the tests work in, after having your experiences? There's not work at all. Were you confident that, that there was nothing wrong with you? You tested positive five times and you tested negative once. Was this enough to convince you that you were healthy? Yes. Yes. Have you ever tested again since? No. No? For the seventh time? Yeah. No, not yet. Do you have a history of STDs? History? No. None? You've never, have you ever had an STD? Mm -hmm. Many women, uh, maybe even one too, they test positive on HIV test, but they've never had an STD. So if AIDS is a sexually transmitted disease, then there would also be a similar frequency of people testing positive for gonorrhea, syphilis, candidiasis, and fever. How many other people have you heard about or met who've had the same experience as you? How many people? Yeah. Uh, having the same experience as you? Oh, there are so many. Are there? Yeah, are there. In Hoima? Mm. They test positive here, mm. negative there. Mm. Positive on this date, mm. negative on another date. Mm. They're there. Do you think the problem in Uganda is HIV spreading or HIV testing spreading? Testing. Testing. They're testing the cause of everything. Yeah. Do you still think it's important for people to know their zero status? Um, it is not important. It's not important. It's not important. Why not? It was useless to me because I went there when I was not sick. Mm. And even now um, you're okay. Even at now, yeah. I'm okay. Yeah, you look fine. No. No single sickness.